Hi everyone. I'm going to do a. Um, uh, I've unboxed and I've got a new Bible and it's uh, not for me. I already have one. Um, got one a couple of weeks ago and it's great. And so I ordered one for a sister in Christ and because uh, I really just wanted to give her one. Um, and um, so I'm just going to show you. It's a TBS uh, Trinitarian Bible Society uh, Windsor text. And it's in uh, burgundy um, calfskin. Yeah. Anyway, let's have a look. Should be that right. Let's see where we're at. Yep. So they they wrap their stuff superbly. Yeah, it uh, comes in a um, big bag, and it's in bubble wrap. Um, it, it, it's in a bag, it's in a, it's in bubble wrap, in a box, in a, in a travel, but in a mailing bag, and it's wrapped in brown paper, and then it's in its own box. So there's a lot, a lot of, um, good packing in this. It's really nice. This is it. And, um, it's King James, of course. And, uh, Oh, that's nice. Nice colour. And every white, of course, with leather, every cover is different. Different texture, different animal. So, uh, that's it. Now, I've done a review of this already, so I won't overly do it. What I'm doing, I won't overly review this one. What I'm going to do is, um, if I can get this in the right place, this camera, show you. I'm going to do what I've learnt recently uh, about breaking, it's called breaking it in, it sounds terrible doesn't it, breaking in a Bible but um, it's just to help um, um, just protect, uh, help the, the, the stitching like apparently, the binding because it's smith sewn uh, to be flexible from the start and the cover so what you do is, you do oh, I wish I had a bit more, I've got a cup of tea right behind my camera tripod there we go. So what you do is you start by um, you start on the outside and you just smooth you smooth what what's in front of you. So you smooth that. And you can see where it's um, bound in there, and then you just take a, just a few pages, not too many, and you give them a smooth smooth the other side the same. So you're just taking a few pages at a time, same amount, sort of on each side, and then smooth them down. And I think that just helps sort of uh, get the binding used to being opened, uh, rather than just sort of cracking it open and getting on, get, getting on with the reading. Um, and I learnt this a few weeks ago and I thought oh that's really nice and I did it when I got mine my this exact same Bible um, and uh, so I'll just work my way through that and it just eases it a little bit nicely and then almost in the middle just be sort of gentle but firm and that's that one there's two ribbons and what I'm going to do for this is what I did with mine they're just sort of cut and they're a little crinkled so um, i show you mine uh, so this one's mine, that's hers. Even the colour is uh, slightly different. Hers is pinkier, mine's sort of darker. And the ribbons are slightly different colour too, obviously, the, whatever batch they're doing. And that's mine. And what I did was I cut them with a knife down on a car piece of cardboard at a 45 degree angle. And um, I also uh, reset them. Because they're kind of really close together, so I um, I've learnt how to reset or even change um, ribbons. 
Yeah, because they put them on top of each other. So I'm going to reset hers. I'm going to take these out and iron those down because they're a bit wrinkly. And I'm going to cut those ends at a nice 45 degree angle. Nice and sharp. But they're really pretty. They feel nice. Satiny, both sides. Nice red. I'll take them out for now. And um, so that's the Bible. It's a, a really beautiful typeface. Um, King James. Uh, and it's printed in the um, and bound by uh, Raw Youngblood in the Netherlands as um, they do the best Bibles. Um, uh -huh. Printed and bound in Belarus, correct myself. Uh, mine was done and printed and bound in the by Royal Youngblood in the Netherlands, but um, probably same thing. So let me show you a bit. I'm trying to find a front page. But um translate this to the reader. Lovely Bibles though anyway, but there's a bit of general text. Beautiful typeface, so easy to read. Um, I like reading this one in bed at night and because uh, it's sort of light and I always hold them up like that anyway. because uh, I the way I sit and read, I don't read at the table. But um that's for my sister in Christ. As soon as I've fixed up those ribbons, I'm going to pack it off and hopefully get it in the post to her today. And they've got lovely gilding too, by the way. Really nice Bible. And um, um, uh, they have a, a, a quite a flexible cover, and the more you use it, and even the more you sort of, you know, mold it just a little bit, uh, it gets softer, but... Um, yeah, it depends on the leather. Mine's a mine's, mine feels completely different. Mine's a feels a bit stiffer, uh, and you can see the grain slightly different, and the colour. Don't you can see that? Yeah, mine, hers. Anyway, oh, hers looks really beautiful, and I want it to be beautiful for her. And um, she lives in the next state over from where I am in Australia. I'm in South Australia, and she's in Victoria. So. Um, I love giving gifts. She doesn't know it's coming, so it'll be a surprise. I like giving people a surprise. Why not? It's half the fun, isn't it? Get something in the mail. Ooh, didn't expect that. Anyway, thanks for watching. God bless.